Snow White, while escaping from her wicked stepmother, meets her dear nanny Molly, old and blind, but very much loved by the children of the village. Snow White and her friends decide to build a hut for the children to play in secret, since the queen has forbidden any type of amusement. Unfortunately, Samson is spotted by the royal soldiers, and... Snow White! Miss Snow White! Yes, I am here. What is it, Miss Bower? I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. What? What I don't like is the fact that you have the same name as our princess. Just because you were born on the same day is no reason to call yourself Snow White. But... You're a simple subject like the rest of us, and you should behave accordingly. Oh, no. Not Miss Bower again. Oh, no. I accidentally called her Snow White in front of everyone. Well, not to worry. I realize you are a very pretty young girl, but Princess Snow White, whom I have the honor to know personally, is the most beautiful girl in all the kingdom. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. Boy, that is one dim-witted woman. That or she's blind. Uh, by the way, didn't you come by to ask me something? Uh, yes, of course, you're right. And what is it? Uh, what was it again? Uh Let's go! Yeah! First of all, I'd like to show you all the wonderful clothes that I design and sew with my own two hands. And then I'd like to start teaching you all the ways you can begin to help me out. Does that sound good? Uh, sure. <laughs> hey, look! Snow White is coming! <laughs> Come, children, I'm going to give you your first lesson in embroidery. Oh, oh really? Okay. Of course. Hurry up, children. We don't have any time to lose. But we were playing blind man's bluff. Don't be so childish. <laughs> Let's uh -huh. go. Uh, but wait, children, where are you going? Oh. I got you. Now it's your what turn. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Come on, aren't you chasing us? You can't be serious. Oh, <laughs> that's my towel. I'm going to get you. Uh -huh, you can't. You can't catch us! <laughs> you can't catch us! <laughs> come on, come on! You're gonna catch us! <laughs> Ooh, you can't catch us! You can't catch us! <laughs> no, no, where are you, you going? Can't catch us. Come Don't on, go! Teacher. Why don't you come on over here and play with the other kids? Uh, huh? Oh, no need to be shy. I just want to be your friend. <sighs> May I? Of course. I've seen you in the village, haven't I? Oh. <gasps> Go ahead. Why don't you have a little? My name is Mary. I used to live in a town that is very, very far away. You used to? My family and I were caught up in a terrible war. Everything I've ever known has been destroyed. My house, the streets, I've not seen my parents since. The war is expanding and it shows no sign of slowing down. Destroying everything in its path. So does that mean you're all alone now? No, from now on she'll be with us. 
Molly, don't you think there's room for one more person to live with us? Of course there is, my dear. Oh, but I... Don't worry about a thing. One more member of the family won't be a problem. We'd love to have you. Yes, you're right. Don't be afraid, my dear. I'll look after you for as long as you wish to stay here with us. It's been a long time since I first heard those words. Really? How long ago? <laughs> <laughs> so, I can stay? Of course you can, Mary. Come on, you uh, must stay with us. Uh, 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 thank you, thank you so much. Uh, thank you. I've always wanted a big sister. I'd love to be your big sister, Mary. Oh, but I don't even know your name. Oh, you can call me Snow White. Snow White. Oh, Snow White. Guards, lower the drawbridge at once. It's a matter of utmost urgency. Please, let me in. I am Richard of Albertville. I carry an urgent message. I must speak to the queen at once. Oh, there's a new girl. I've never seen her before. I wonder where she came. Oh, shh. All right, is everybody ready to welcome our new friend? Yes, teacher. One, two, three. Welcome to our school, Mary. We hope you'll be our friend. Oh, thank you so much, everybody. It's really great to meet you. My name's Mateo, and I'm eight years old. If you need any help at all, don't hesitate to come to me, okay? Hey, Mateo, I thought you were in love with Snow uh, White. Hey, what are you talking about? <laughs> That's not fair. Take it back. Hi, Mary. I hope we will be friends, too. Pleased to meet you. Do you want to play with us? What do you like to play? Of course. I have an idea. Why don't we play jump rope or hide and seek? <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Here, I uh, made this for you, Mary. Here, I made this for you. Huh? Mm. Uh, oh, uh, it looks great on you. Do you really think so? She is beautiful, huh? Mm. Now shut uh -oh. up and fight! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Hey, watch it. Uh -oh. Uncle. Thank you so much, my friends. You've made me feel so pretty. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? The Queen isn't here? Where can I find her? Due to the current political situation, Her Majesty the Queen has been forced to leave the country. Well, we must get word to her at once. Her Majesty must return to the castle immediately. I'm afraid that will not be possible. We don't have the slightest idea as to her whereabouts. But that's... that's outrageous. Leave the message with me. I'll be sure she gets it upon her return. Perhaps you'll go out of your way to tell her that King Conrad has been badly wounded. What's that? Our beloved king has been wounded? Yes, and the war has cost us even more casualties. The situation oh. is quite grim. I'm here to ask for more troops. Very well. Report back to the king and tell him we will do our best. Thank you. Farewell. One more thing! I also have a message for the Princess Snow White, if that would be all right. Gah! I wonder what happened. He certainly seems to be upset. I think that young man may be the Prince of Albertville. <laughs> ah, yes, the Prince of Albertville. The princess is recovering as we speak. What? Where is she? The Queen is the only one who knows. She is taking care of her personally. Well, I want to see her at once. Please, you must tell me where I can find her. I'm sorry, that will not be possible. There is nothing we can do. Nothing you can do? Something serious must have happened. Snow White, where are you? Snow White! Things are going really well. Mary seems to be making fast friends with all of the children. I'm 
glad she's doing so well. At first I was a little worried, but when I saw her with the others, I knew it'd be okay. Princess, you've changed so much since you were a little girl. You seem capable of handling almost anything now. I'm absolutely sure you can do anything you put your mind to. <gasps> Snow White? Yes, Molly? Don't you think you'd be happier here with me than back at the castle? I don't know, Molly. Snow White, what I'm asking you is, would you like to stay here with me and the children? Well, sure. That would be great, but I don't know. <laughs> oh, Molly, I really wish I could do something more. You are certainly free to do as you wish. No, I'm not talking about myself. I used to be naive, but now I have grown up, and I realize the true importance of helping others. Helping others is the most important duty a queen or any woman could pursue. Princess. I don't understand why the children have been forbidden to play. This seems to me to be cruel and unnecessary. But if I were still living at the castle, this would not have happened. Oh, don't say that, my dear. Oh. Oh. <gasps> don't say that, my dear. None of this is your fault. You cannot blame yourself, Snow White. The only one to blame is that wicked queen. You are wise and wonderful, Molly. But I must not forget that one day I will be queen, too. Oh, good day, ladies. Oh, hello, Harvey. I'm happy to report that I sold all your vegetables, Molly. They were quite in demand. Here, I brought you the money. <gasps> oh, my. Thank you very much. Think nothing of it. It's my pleasure. But I've got to tell you, I think there may be trouble brewing. Huh? I have the feeling that something very serious has happened. What do you mean? Excuse me, please speak your mind freely. This morning, I saw a prince leaving the castle, and he seemed very upset. A prince, you say? Yes, I was carrying your vegetables when... I wonder what happened. He certainly seems to be upset. Whatever it is, let's just hope it's not too serious. I hope for everyone's sake this war will be over soon. Well, I've got some work to do. Take care. Thanks again, princess. <gasps> Mr. Harvey! What is it, Snow White? I don't know if you happen to notice it, but did you see the prince's coat of arms? Yes, I certainly did. When I looked at him, I noticed he had a hawk on his armor. And a hawk can only mean one thing. He must be an Albertville. An Albertville hawk? Yes, that's the one. Well, I'm off. Molly, it must be Richard. He came to the castle. Is something wrong, Snow White? Samson, I can't help it, but I'm worried about Richard. Mm. I'm coming with you. You better stay here. I don't want you to get hurt. Where do you think he is? The prince is probably looking for you right now. I think so, too. The soldiers are looking for Samson. We better escort him. Don't worry, Snow White. We'll take good care of Samson. Snow White, don't you know the Prince of Albertville? Uh, I guess you could say so. Let's take a shortcut to the Queen's summer residence. Prince Richard must be heading for it. Ah, oh, I'm so fed up with those kids. Snow White. 
Oh, excuse me, Ms. Bauer. Uh, pardon me. I I'm in a hurry. Please. Oh, Snow White, you won't believe this. The most terrible thing just happened to me. I fell down by the side of the road just as a knight was passing, and can you believe it? He didn't even stop to help me. I'm sorry about that, but do you know if he was on a white horse? Yes, and he was quite a good-looking young man, but terribly rude. Ms. Bauer, it's very important. Which direction was he going? He was galloping toward the woods. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Where are you going, young lady? I haven't finished my story yet. Come back here. <sighs> oh, these young people today, they have no respect for anyone. This looks familiar. I know this path. Snow White? Oh, Mary, it's you. I just wanted to thank you. I've been having such a wonderful time with all my new friends. But then I heard that something very serious had happened. You were there. Is everything okay? I'm very worried. Thank you for asking, Mary, but it is grown-up business. Therefore, you don't have to worry. I'm fine, really. See you later. No, Snow White, I'm coming with you. You have to let me come and help you. You said you were my big sister, and that's what sisters do, right? Uh, Mary, thank you. I appreciate it, but... <laughs> All right, Mary, come along. Really? I really want you to come with me. <gasps> this lake. Snow White. about me. Just leave me here and go. <laughs> Molly! Molly! Snow White, where have you been all this time? Please take care of Mary. Huh? Where are you going? my fault, I swear. No, it's not your fault. It's nobody's fault. Don't ever mention it again, okay? But I... Tomorrow morning, I want to see you bright and happy like the sunshine. Can you do that? Huh? Then we have a deal. King Conrad has been seriously wounded. Richard was unable to report it to Snow White so she could help. 
Sadly, it seems the two youngsters were never meant to meet. <laughs>